Hello, everybody. Well, welcome back to Elder Scrolls Online. It has been a while. I'm still not out of the woods yet on the family health situations. But today, I thought there would be an exception because today is the day that Endeavors have gone live on Elder Scrolls Online. And we're going to have a look at those and see what they're about, what you're going to get for them, what do you have to do, and what are they for? Probably the most important one is where can you find your daily and weekly tasks that you need to do to complete these. So let's have a look. So first let's have a look at the crown store because I know everybody's been kind of wanting to know what the prices were. There are some changes to the crown store now. You can see that there is a crown button where you can see the normal price of items. And then you have the Seals of Endeavor, which switches over to what can you get for your Seals of Endeavor. So you have your featured items here. These are the top tier items that you can get for Seals of Endeavor. You see this one will cost 7,200 for the Bloodroot Spriggan. And the Bloodroot Wild Hunt Cinch is 9,600 Seals of Endeavor. The Iron Atronach is 8,000 Seals of Endeavor. And the Iron Atronach Wolf is 8,000 Seals of Endeavor. I like to go through and look at the whole thing leveled up. Anyway, so that and that's kind of the featured products, the higher tier items. So these are the limited time offers, are the Bloodroot Spriggan and the Bloodroot Wild Hunt Cinch. You switch over here, you can still get them for crowns in the crown crate. And you'll have to get the gems and the normal way of doing the kind of the loot box system. A little gambling, which I was never a fan of. So. Let's go back to the Seals of Endeavor prices. Radiant Apex Rewards. Here is the other items. Now these are not featured, so they're not time sensitive, but they are going to be here for the duration of these types of crown crates. So these are called the Iron Atronach crates. And so these will be around for a little while while we work towards collecting them. So Radiant Apex Mounts are 16,000 Seals of Endeavor. So these are pretty, pretty cool. Each one is an Atronach with its own special, um, special effect. Very cool. Apex Rewards. Looks like all of the Apex rewards cost 8,000 Seals of Endeavor. And we've kind of looked at those. These are going to be very similar to the Wolf. And then we have a Resplendent Sweet Roll. Okay. I guess it has different stages. Less Sweet. Extra sweet. Well, this is kind of strange because I'm pretty sure I bought this a little while ago for crowns, I want to say. Somewhere. I know I have one laying around on a countertop in one of my houses. Don't ask me which house. So, all of these for 8,000 Seals of Endeavor. Legendary rewards. Looks like all of these will be 3,600 Seals of Endeavor. And just to kind of give you back the um, the comparison, the normally they would be 100 crowns. So just kind of give you a perspective on that. So we have the Brimstone Nixad, the Bull Kaguti Charger, the Dappled Elenir Camel, Deadlands. Chandelier Bladed. 
That's a pretty wicked looking chandelier. We need a big house to put that in. Sounds like a good one to go into the Bas Bastion Sanguinaris one. And we have the Deadlands Exorated Skin Tattoo or Skin Marking. And it seems to go, yeah, it's instead of a tattoo. It's pretty kind of gross. Grand Experience Scroll for, that's a lot of Seals of Endeavor to get one of those. You used to get something like that in the daily rewards. Hist. Soko. I'm going to say Soko. I don't know. So this is another skin. Kind of a like a bark-like thing. And you have Hist. A Hist. Um, sacred Task. Okay. These are the Elder Hists. Okay. That's cool. Inferno Cleats. So I guess this is a memento. So it would only last a few minutes. You can't run around entirely like that all the time. Uh, major all research um, and iron acronach battle axe. So we got them. Oh, dripping lava. Same with the bow, fire and lava, dagger, shield, staff. We've got the Nibbanese noble shawled robe. This is very nice. If you're into the costume collections, very nice one. The Fire Stalker Cub. And a Sol Solstheim Lunar Wolf. That's a very nice wolf. So those are the 3,600 Seals of Endeavor things. Epic. Rewards are the 2,000 Seals of Endeavor, and just to compare, these would be your 40, 40 gem items. Alright, so we got Blowing Bubbles, Emote. That's very cute. Uh, we got the Crocheting. Uh, that is really nice. Look, that's a lot of good detail in there with the with the item that you're crafting. That's very nice. A Deadlands Cage, bladed. Deadlands Sconce, horned. Deadlands Scorpion, to be a little pet. And then a Hearthfire Hatchling. Impartial Decision Coin. Yeah. Uh, instant all research. We got the Knight Aspirant Courting Helm. The Knight Aspirant Tarny Helm. We got more experience scrolls. Morg Tong Spatter Lenses. I've used these before. Those are pretty fun. Nibbanese Laurel Coronet. Medallion Liege Brow Median? Medallion, sorry. Stitch for Cavi. Look at that guy. It's kind of like a... Kind of like a rabbit with a smaller ears. A Tourmaline Swamp Jelly. So all of that for 2,000 Seals of Endeavor. And superior rewards are 1,000 Seals of Endeavors. We got some Dagon's Aspirant Body Markings. Dagon's Aspirant Face Markings. Fire Salts. Gold Spine Boar. Oh, look at it rolls around. Talon's Jackal, just a little baby jackal. Iliac Spotted Goat, add to your goat collection. I know we've got a few goats for pets right now. Knight Aspirant Caress. Now, the shoulders are not part of this. Just so you know, those are part of my costume. 
But this is the Knight Aspirant Cuirass and nice Knight Aspirant Gauntlets. Knight Aspirant Girdle. Or belt. Knight Aspirant Greaves. Knight Aspirant Helm. Your basic hoodie. Uh, Knight Aspirant Pauldron, so that's where your shoulders come in there. Knight Aspirant Sabatons. The Necrom Ghost Gazer Cat. Uh, don't tell anyone, but I think it looks like a Siamese cat. Okay, just it's, but it's a Necrom Ghost Gazer Cat. This is a two oh boy. It's some kind of a Hajimoto. Hajimota? Because I can't say the first part of this. I can barely say the second. So it's a little pet that comes after you. And then a Dova fly. Well, okay. I do not know why Miri has suddenly decided to rise up off of the ground. Very strange. But the Dova fly is beautiful. Spicy soup. Oh my goodness. Souls, Dan, Prophet, marking, body markings. Oh, I like this. There's a lot of details in this one. And the matching face markings. The triptych motion body markings. Also a lot of very sharp detail here. And the matching face markings. And the Coral Dale Mud Crabs. Very pretty blue iridescent mud crab. Then we go to Fine Rewards. Now these are the typical things that we usually get from the crown crates that you turn in for gems, usually. So, um, another Gold Coast Experience Scroll. A bunch of dyes. We got some beguiling. Basically, black and red is the theme for this little season, so why not? Um, and we got the tanksters and the liquors, and all of this is 360 seals of endeavor. And then the common rewards, of course, are the potions, the mimic stones, and so forth. Those are 360 seals of endeavor. Kind of like exactly the same as the fine rewards. Um, let's just take a look. This would be three gems and that would be five gems. So don't anybody tell them that the fine rewards should be more than the common rewards. But you might want to tell them the common rewards have to be less than the fine rewards. I don't know. So that's basically what you can get with these seals of endeavor and those are kind of the prices we're looking at. Okay, so in the group content button, you would click that and now you'll see that there is now a section for endeavors. And right now, all we have is the dailies. So you can pick three. You can see that there are zero out of three completed. So you can pick three, but there's a variety here. So it kind of depends on your gameplay method. If you like to PvP, you're probably going to get this one pretty quickly. Killing 10 human foes, you'll probably get this while you're questing or running through Tamriel. Looting treasure chests, crafting items at the blacksmithing skill. You know, if you do your daily craftables, this will be easy to get done. Um, kill 15 foes with your class ability. I mean, you could probably knock out the humanoid and the class ability ones almost at the same time. Uh, so that doesn't look too hard to me. It just takes a couple of minutes to get those done. The weekly ones apparently are not coming until next week because we've already started now on a Thursday so we don't have an entire week to get a weekly done so the next time that we get to have these will be starting next week and that's about it for the seals of endeavor yeah if you've uh, wondered what's going on with my character there's there's an add-on that changes her 
style of standing around while I'm busy doing other things. So it's kind of like an AFK module that goes through some of the emotes while we're waiting for me to get back to the game. So that's what she's doing. Kind of fun, but sometimes it's annoying if you're trying to take a picture and suddenly she just disappears because she has to do push-ups. Anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope you have fun with the Seals of Endeavor. I'm really glad that this is here. Take care, everybody, and I will see you next time. Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this presentation. Please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel, Oma Games. If you would like to see my live streams, please go to twitch.tv and follow Miss Oma. Take care, everybody and I will see you next time.